Okay, so like me, you, you've got problems with uh, the keyboard, you get cramps in your hands. Every time you use WASD, because these kids today think that's the best way to control the game, hate it. Always, you know, if, I, if I'm using my left hand, I get a cramp in, in my palm here. If I'm using my right hand on the, on the arrows, I get a cramp in my hand here. So I always use, uh, you see that, the, the, the PS4 controller, or before that, the PS, whatever. But it's got to be this one because it's been designed and developed for people like me, I guess. The, 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 do they call it ergonomic? But anyway, so if you're here, you've got the problem with the wrap, just like what I have, because it was built just for mouse and keyboard. Forget everybody else, it's just for mouse and keyboard. But I bought it today, I've got my controller. Pre-test it was working, so I want to show you, I want to show you where I'm at. Or what you know, how to let's see, let's see if we can set it up. I think we can set it up. Um, so here we go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna launch Raft as it is, as you will get it on Steam. Right, it'll load up. Oh, it's already look, it's already working for some reason. You can see that I'm using the thumbstick and the, and the cursor's going around, right? And this is good. It works on the mouse, the mouse is just here to the right, that, that works. Now, how are you doing it? Because that shouldn't have been like that, in all honesty. You go, you're coming down to the bottom right, I'll just exit the game. Come down to the bottom right, and you look, look, look by right here, look. And you'll see Steam, right? You right-click on it, and you press Big Picture. What will what'll open up is, is Steam. Quite loud. I wasn't expecting that, by the way. Um, you go into this little globe thing up the top. And you go into controller. And that's all you check over. And then once you're there, if, if you've got this um, unchecked, turn off controller with accident big picture mode. So that it's going to stay on. So you go to the menu. Go to power, exit bit picture mode. Right, and just minimize that, get that out of the way, because the team's being weird at the moment. Go back into raft. And instantly, if, if your if your right thumbstick moves, and you can see that, right? You can see me moving the right thumbstick. If it moves, you you, you curse, you know you, you know your controller's set up. I've never played raft before, because I could I couldn't buy it because of the controller, but yeah, let's just try peaceful mode. One, two, three. Just while we're doing this. Right? PS4 controller. Just disappeared. <laughs> well, I'm moving it around. We only ever want something to quick and easy right when when you're playing a game you don't want to be fucking about in settings and all that stuff you just want to press a few clicks and have it open running right let me show you what the controls are inside the game as well and um, hopefully this will help anyone with control with issues that want to there we go so that's the that's the that's the right thumbstick moving around, and the left the left thumbstick is movement. Um, if you if you do want to change the perspective, because I know a lot of people don't like this first person, if you press the comma button, which is next to M, you can get that up. That, that's not on the controller. That's the only one I I've I played the game before, but that's the only one that's not on the controller. But you can do that, and there's the moving about with the thumbsticks and whatnot. You can change the speed of that all you want. To throw your hook, or you're holding in R2, right? To reel it in, R2 again, right trigger. If you if you if you mess one up, I like this. I like this. So I missed I missed that one. Look, you press L2, come straight back. So L2 is like a recall, I guess. X is jump. Uh, triangle is to drop something, uh, and the square is to pick it back up. So that's fairly easy. 
left and right will toggle your your bottom inventory which is great um down uh, brings up something in the top right I, I don't know why you would want that um but yeah that just tells all your information of your pc um and up brings up this little menu where you can use your uh, thumbstick to go over you don't even need to touch your mouse you can touch your mouse if you want to to bring it open i guess it's a bit quicker because it, it's moving much faster um to build stuff i guess that's your build menu right and to get out is up again and then uh, triangle uh no not triangle sorry square uh, circle <laughs> we'll, get, we'll get there eventually brings up this menu so you can do what you want in there um, settings, you have to press R, right trigger to click, because that's technically your left mouse button, where you can go in and have a look, um, and change this about, like that's to do with the look speed I guess, um, that, but not the actual mouse movement speed, uh, which I can't find to, like, this is, this. I guess you would find this somewhere in Windows setting, or Steam setting to increase this mouse speed, it's not too bad, it's not too, it's really not too bad. Um, and everything else is in here by, you know, you, I don't need to pick, I don't need to touch the controller, the, the, the keyboard. We're all good. Exit, no. Just exit the menu, please. Circle. There we go. So, let's, um, let me go and pick my hook up. Chuck some stuff in. So it's not too bad, you see. You can't. I don't think you can press L one while. Um, if you've got something in your hook, you, you can't press L one to bring it back. L two, rather. Oh, I'm pressing L. I'm pressing L two now. Nothing. Nothing comes off. But right trigger brings in your hook nicely. Yeah. Where's my hook? <laughs> no, I never played it before, but... Okay. I must I must be doing something wrong there. Ah, there's some sort of mini glitch there. But anyway, that's how you play the Raft with a PS4 controller in 2023. You have to use Steam, you use the big picture, and you'll be great.